Triple M Grilty. We're about to speak to one of our favourite guests on the no. show. Yeah. That's Tony Popovich, the Wanderers FC coach, and they're into their grand final again. Tony, welcome to the Grill Team. Morning, guys. Mate, you must be absolutely thrilled, mate. You've had such a wonderful season, not only in the A-League, but in uh, in Asia as well, in the Champions League. Um, but all focused now up in Brisbane Sunday afternoon. Yeah, definitely. It's um, you know it's been another good season. The players have uh, uh, done a great job uh, maintaining those high standards that they had last year. And, um, you know, we really look forward to, to Brisbane and then trying to put it right this year. Yeah, Papa, there was that feeling last year that once uh, that there was almost like everyone was just over the moon and sort of talking about the fairy tale. The fact is, it had just made it. Is there a different feel about this year? Is there more of an urgency that we're here, we've got to win it? Yeah, it, it does feel different, uh, and I suppose uh, experience helps. Uh, it was our first one for uh, for everyone, coaching staff, players. Um, this year, just a different feel about it. And a couple of reasons for that. I think uh, the Asian Champions League has certainly toughened us up mentally. Uh, in the last two months, we've basically been playing every three days and travelling. And also, last year, we had suspensions and injuries leading into uh, the final. So the players weren't quite at their best. Uh, so they're, they're the two main differences. And, um, you know, we really want this one uh, on Sunday. Popper, not much gets spoken about uh, the goalies in, in either team, but I, I've got to give a good rap to Ante Kovic. Um, the, the bloke isn't getting any younger, but, gee, he seems to be getting better. Yeah, he does. He's uh, he's been outstanding for us, and with his leadership and uh, his experience at the back, and um, you know he's 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 racked up over ten clean sheets again this year, and uh, you know you know we're very pleased with him, and um, you know he's, he's a model professional. And, um, you know, I think he's still got a long way to go. Mate, one of the great things about going out to your games, which we've done a few times this year, is the crowd. Oh, yeah. Unfortunately, it's up at Suncorp at Brisbane's ground. Um, what can we do what, as Western Wanderers fans if you can't get up to the game? Is there, is there an opportunity for everyone to get together and watch the game at a fan zone or something like that? Yeah, I think the, the club's actually in the process of uh, organising something now as we speak. Um, Due to the high demand and, and the interest in the game from our fans, I think uh, you know they're they're trying to get uh, the, the people uh, in the west together, the ones that can't make it up there. But um, you know it'll be a wonderful atmosphere up uh, in Brisbane, and you know we're we're told we we should be uh, upward of uh, ten thousand fans wow. there. Wow! Wow! Unreal. So, uh, you know, the noise they can create, regardless oh. of the numbers. Yeah. Um, you know, it, should, it will be a special day. Uh, Papa, work with Mark Guy here, Mark. Guy, of course, a Mount Druid boy who's been a big supporter of the Western Sydney Wanderers from the moment they've come in. He, he sees them as their, almost like the, the ambassador from another code. Mate, you know, I'd just like to, if you want him to get up in the sheds before the game, I mean, you are up against the Queensland side and you, you probably saw what he did with Wally Lewis, mate. He's, he is available. No. Yeah, that, that, that's good to know. Man. I'll keep that one up my sleeve. You know, could, could need to wake up a few of my boys before the game. Good, good on you, Papa. Good on you, Papa. Mate, you've always been available for us, brother. And, and who would who would have thought we'd be thinking speaking to you the same time exactly as last year? You've done it again, mate. Um, I know you don't. You're not one for wrapping yourself, but we will. You've been a sensational manager or leader of or gaffer of these gaffer. Uh, of, of these boys, and uh, <laughs> you know you need a big pat in the back, brother. Well done. No, nah, thanks a lot, guys. I appreciate your support throughout the year. Now, now, Papa, I know you're going to go to a few other radio stations, but, mate, uh, what other radio station will give you your own song? Papa, don't reach. <laughs> <laughs> There's a message in there, Papa, don't reach. Brother. Love it, love it. Brilliant. <laughs> Good Thank you very well done, much. Well guys. Good on you. The Triple M Grilty.